Hey guys, welcome back to Coin Knowledge. Today we're here looking at Curaverse, which in my opinion is aiming to be potentially the Fortnite of Web3 and on the blockchain. If you guys are a fan of crypto gaming and just gaming as a whole, or even Fortnite, whatever, Battle Royales, consider subscribing to the channel and liking some of the videos. Your support means a lot. And if we look here at Curaverse, so Curaverse, the ultimate third person shooter engineered for the future of multiplayer gaming. And uh, they do have a trailer here, and you can mint Akira right now with ETH, and you can get beta access. And this is just going to be a quick overview, just bringing this project to your attention. Again, none of this is financial advice, and I will be linking this website below so you guys can take a look at it. But Curaverse, if we look here, what is Curaverse? So Curaverse is an online multiplayer game created in Unreal Engine 5 for gamers across the globe to play, compete, and earn to unlock or rent character skin, weapons, and more digital ownership in the hands of gamers worldwide and what is cool about Curaverse is that they are building on immutable x which is a platform and just a project as a whole that i'm a fan of if we look here at the trailer of Curaverse, you can kind of see how i'm thinking it maybe is aiming to be again like that fortnite battle royale uh setting of the blockchain of web3 if you see here it looks very similar to Fortnite and as we all know whether you like it or not or whether you play it or not or if you're a fan Fortnite is super popular and super profitable it's one of those games where as I say most profitable games are typically free to play games you know you look at Fortnite Apex Valorant Warzone all the money isn't in the game it's in on the NFTs on the web through gaming or traditional gaming skins you can buy so take a look at that but it is cool and it does look you know Again, like that Fortnite, which can bring a lot of attention here. Again, we saw how big Fortnite got and how big it still is. So, if we see here, Kiraverse Season 1 Training Grounds. So, Kiraverse is launching with two game modes currently at the time of this recording, being Battle Royale and Elimination and three competitive extensions. Again, players can earn tokens in free-to-play free mode to use on to use on their in-game marketplace to purchase skins, weapons, more digital assets. Again, think weapon skins. Think, you know, for an example, you can get a skin on your character and kind of show off and have that flex within in-game to all your friends or your enemies. Be like, hey, look at me. I have a lot of hours in this. Or I just have a lot of money to spend in this game. Either way, it's a flex, and that's why people usually do it. Or there might be, you know, advantages, uh, skill advantages. We don't know yet. Or play using our compete and earn extensions to win top crypto such as ETH and USDT, which is very cool. Again, the Battle Royale modes, solos, duos, trios, squads, elimination, 1v1, up all the way up to 10v10. And if we look, free extension, so play for fun in our various Battle Royale modes. Again, Battle Royale is very popular. Wager extensions, so survive to win cash prizes, play competitive, dictating your own risk using our pools structure. An earn per kill extension, non-stop action, each kill equals more money, respawn forever in this endless battle mode. So very cool to have those different extensions or modes. And again, this project will be having an, their own NFT collection. So their Genesis collection will consist of 10,001, not your standard 10,000, but 10,001 unique NFTs that are created by world-renowned artist Antoni and Mark Teskiscu. I'm sure I butchered those names. Kira offers ingenious, crafted, alien-like humans discovered in 4K quality. So you can kind of see what their collections are going to look like. And with these NFTs, you can do you know, a couple things, such as rent Akira. This will allow the users the ability to place their in-game NFTs and integrated characters up for rent for other users to enjoy in-game. In case you can't buy one of yourself, you can rent somebody's Kira so both parties can benefit. And then basic access... So users who do not hold a Kira NFT will only have access to a limited quantity of characters, weapons, skins, and upgrades, and will also earn less Kira tokens for their gameplay compared to holders. Again, more incentive to be a Kira NFT holder, and free players will still have access to all game modes and free play. Premium access. Again, if you have that Kira NFT, you can stake to earn Kira passively, NFT rental, free matches, free in-game skins, purchase earn all characters and weapons again more incentives to be a kira nft holder and you will be able to bring your nfts to life so currently they are working to bring all kinds of nft collections to life by creating 3d avatars from the base of any traditional nft and making it playable in game 
if we see here, you can see like board eight, the board apes, you know, neon cats, uh, I think it's crypto punks, I, I think. Uh, and then you can bring your own NFT to the Kiroverse. Just, there's a forum there. And if you look at their roadmap, kind of what they have going on right now. So this is obviously quarter four of 2022, NFT and game development. So they will have their open beta for the training grounds and then being able to mint those Genesis Cure collections and then season one and then quarter one of next year, 2023 or this year, 2023, uh, extensive marketing campaign, release new items, partnerships, building the project, licensing, introduction of land, introduction of the box, quarter two. Again, this is just the current roadmap at the time of this recording. All of it is subject to change, more updates, land of T release, season two, and then quarter three and so forth. Very cool to see. And if you look at, they do have their frequently asked questions here. So who are the creators? Great question. So Param Labs and AAA game and technology development co company. So you can expect quality from Param Labs being that AAA company. When will the game be out? Kiroverse has been playable and in private alpha since quarter three of 2022. We are currently aiming for our public release to commence in quarter four, 2022, with two main game modes, again, being Elimination and Battle Royale, which we went over. And you can sign up and register to be uh, to have updates. And then the Kira token, so the Kira token is a token of the Kiroverse ecosystem. Kira is an in-game currency only, meaning it is not tradable nor security, and it cannot be or it can be used to purchase NFTs on the Kira marketplace, only which then can be traded freely, used in game, or listed on other mutable X supported marketplace. So again, that Kira token you do accumulate as you play in free mode or compete in earn modes and adds users accounts as they play autonomously based on in-game achievements unlocked also you will be able to purchase cura tokens within their marketplace using major debit cards so it sounds like they will have some kind of on-ramp system which is always nice to see kind of gets rid of one of those tough barriers for a lot of people in web3 or just crypto as a whole is how to even get your hands on some of the tokens or current in-game currencies having that on-ramp with those credit card debit cards is going to be very nice Again, eliminating a barrier of entry to a lot of people if they're not crypto or Web3 savvy, per se. And obviously, is their game free to play? Yes, their game is going to be free to play for everyone. No paywall, which I like that. Although, again, they're going to have those different modes where higher stakes. But that's why you have that paywall there. Or the NFT wall and then what devices are supported. Right here, it kind of shows the specs, what you're going to be having to need if you plan on paying playing this this project or this game and then how can you bring your nft to life again they have that link fill out the form if you're interested in the mint price you can look at their uh current genesis right now and the big thing which i want to capitalize on here is so the partners and team experience so if we see here they will introduce kiraverse to millions of gamers and as a longtime leader in the gaming industry gamestop yes gamestop and immutable x are powering the next generation of games so we did know that GameStop, I believe, had their NFT marketplace with Immutable X. So they are involved here, GameStop Immutable X. Very, very cool to see. And if you look here, their team does come from various big companies like Luminosity, Epic Games, Samsung, Atari, Apple, Nike, Google, Adobe. Huge projects. And if you are interested in kind of staying up to date with this project, they do have, you know, obviously Discord, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, uh, all linked at the bottom of their website, which again, I'll be linking this website beneath so you guys can take a look at Kiraverse and do a little bit more of an in-depth deep dive if this is a project you're interested in. But let me know in the comments below what you think of Kiraverse, if you think this is a cool project, if you're not about Battle Royales, if if you're a fan of Fortnite and you are excited to see a project like that, or if you see the potential for like a Fortnite project on the blockchain as far as like bringing adaption and players. And let me know... Again, let me know what you think of this project. If there's other projects you want me to review or that you think I should focus my attention on, let me know and I'll make a video on them if you know the research checks out. Uh, either way, I just saw this project, Kiroverse, and I thought, again, Fortnite was huge, and GameStop Mutable X is nothing to you know ignore. But that's my opinion. Again, no, this financial advice is bringing this project to your attention. So let me know in the comments below, again, and if you guys can like the video, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share the video, and I will catch you guys in the next one. All right, see you guys.